Michael and Selena Lombardo from Life Poured Out International. Happy Thanksgiving. We wanted to encourage you today with the Word of God. In 1 Thessalonians 5.18, the Apostle Paul says, In everything give thanks, for this is the will of God in Christ Jesus. First of all, he's saying, in everything. So no matter what you're going through, hardship, lack, whether you're believing for a breakthrough, whether there's you know family struggles or you know things happening in church or whatever else, you know, he says, no matter what is happening in your life, give thanks. This is God's will. This is what he desires. It brings him pleasure. When we look upon Jesus, when we look upon what he has accomplished for us, when we look around and, we, and we're searching for all the blessings, even in the middle of, you know, struggle or seeming lack in our lives. So look for the blessings this Thanksgiving. Thank him for friends, family, you know, thank him for the future breakthrough that is going to be taking place in your lives. Just cultivate that thankful heart and then you'll be doing God's will this Thanksgiving. Amen. Um, I just want to remind you all that you are fearfully and wonderfully made. He wants you to know that you are unique and beautiful. Your life, your journey, your story is beautiful. And whatever you go through, whether it may seem good or bad, it's all part of his plan. He works it out for your good. And they just wanted to also, you know, warn you of the danger of comparison. Right now we see all of these ads and all of these commercials about um, material things, the, the better, the, the new, the newest, the greatest. But we just need to be content in mm. where we are in Christ, in wow. our life, where we are, where we are right now. The specific season that you're in is ordained by God. And it's just a great time to reflect on the fact that you were fearfully and wonderfully and uniquely made. Your purpose in this life is unlike anyone else. And that's why God made us all different. Because if there was a prototype, then we would just look at that prototype and we could compare ourselves to that prototype. But he made each one of us different and unique so that we could rely and depend on him. And it'd be a, an adventure full of faith, full of love, peace and joy, fulfillment and satisfaction. And that's what we pray for today for you and in this season and even going into Christmas, just knowing that we have it all in Christ. And so just be grateful and just be so filled with love and joy today in Jesus name. Amen. The Apostle Paul said, you know, I, I learned to be content. You have to learn to be content. He said, I've had little and I've had a lot, but I've learned to be content. I could do all things through Christ who strengthens me. Mm -hmm. So we just hold on to that word and we cultivate that attitude in our hearts. We just want to thank you. We love you and we value you here at Life Poured Out International. We pray for all of you, our partners, those who are faithfully watching and, and following our ministries, those who receive these newsletters and updates. So more information coming out soon. We just wanted to say thank you so much for being who you are and for being a part of this journey. We love you. Have an amazing day. We couldn't do this without you. Thank you to all of our partners and have a wonderful Thanksgiving. Yes. Amen.